the fastest air breathing manned aircraft and my all time favourite, the SR 71 Air Blackbird. One of the most amazing aeroplanes ever built, the SR 71 Air Blackbird originated from the CIA's request for a replacement for the U 2 spy plane. Like many top secret projects, it was entrusted to Lockheed's famous Skunk Works team, headed by the famous Kelly Johnson, a name which keeps appearing on this channel. They came up with the A-12, first in 1962, and then the slightly larger SR-71 in December 1964. The fastest air-breathing manned aircraft. I think the only thing that's faster is the Space Shuttle. The SR-71 was designed to fly at three times the speed of sound, over 2,000 miles per hour, and at an altitude in excess of 80,000 feet, I believe its surface ceiling was 85,000. Overflying hostile territory on photo reconnaissance missions, everything about the aircraft was novel. From its heat resistant lightweight titanium alloy skin to the combined turbojet slash ram engines super efficient at supersonic speed. The elegant fuselage was actually thinner than the huge engine pods mounted on the wings. The SR-71 was finished in radar absorbent black paint. In an early attempt at stealth, however, its survival was guaranteed not by evading radar detection, but by flying so fast and so high for a ground launch missile to do damage. Its cruising speed was phenomenal. It could cross the United States from coast to coast in just over an hour. The SR-71 was introduced into service in 1966. The last of these amazing aircraft were retired in 1998. And if I'm right, the titanium that was used in its construction was bought from the Soviet Union. Through I fly, through the valley of death, I shall fear no evil. For I'm 80,000 feet and climbing. Sign over the entry to the SR-71 operating location, Kanden A Air Base, Okinawa. Specifications. Power plant, two 32,500 pound static thrust Pratt & Whitney J58-1 JT-11D 20B continuous bleed after burning turbojet engines SR-71A wingspan 55 feet 7 inches wing area 1,800 square feet length 107 feet 5 inches gross weight 170,000 pounds maximum speed absolute speed record Mach 3.3 plus 3,529.56 kilometers an hour or 2,193.167 miles per hour. Wow. Combat range 3,355 miles. Accommodation to crew. First flight 24th of April 1962. A11 ox carts. 22nd of December 1964. SR71. So what I can tell you without looking on any websites is because the aircraft flew that high it would actually expand so where they put the fuel so what I can tell you without looking up any external websites is because the aircraft would expand during flight which is amazing in itself to think about but where they put the fuel in the tanks even though this aircraft was designed in the 60s and it could fly three times faster than the speed of sound, I don't know if they had expanding form back then, but there was nothing that they ever came up with that properly sealed the fuel tanks. And even now, in museums, it still leaks. And for some reason, nobody's come up with any solution for it, even nowadays. It's the fastest aircraft to fly from New York to London, and I believe the time was 3 hours and 20 minutes. Wow. If all flights could be like that. And if you truly think about it, in terms of speed and aircraft, and we now live in 2023, 
speeds have actually decreased rather than the other way around and I do think that's quite sad.